Hello once again. This is episode three, Long Road Ahead. Now it's gonna do this little play previously on the Walking Dead thing, so let's watch and enjoy. Previously on the Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it! No! <laughs> Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandit's got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Well, that's that. I already know about this. Now, tell me something I don't know. I'm not gonna do the thing anymore. Good iron. Shut up. You guys are a bunch of downers. City. Why are we running? Looks like this is our lucky day. Yeah, this might actually go smoothly. We deserve it after last time. What happened last time? Tell me. I want to know. <sighs> Man. Lee, where do you come down on staying or going? You mean, packing up the motel and getting in the RV? Yeah, we've been talking about it, but have you made up your mind yet? I thought I was going. Uh, yeah. We should go. The motel's run its course, and it's not safe. You're damn right it has. We pile into the RV and don't pull over till we see water. And if Lily's dead set on staying, then, well, that's the way it goes. Well, then she can stay. I'm okay with that. How did a helicopter crash into the... Good okay, thing we didn't stay just there. just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. Good thing we, we didn't, didn't stay leave there. much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <laughs> Shit. I'm you to okay? Go. The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. That's not gonna hold me. There's no way. Barely even held Looks my like hands. she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. We better get a move on. Wait, what was that? What was that? I'm not gonna push it. That's, that's crazy. Lily's not doing so good, huh? Oh. Well, we did kill her dad. Well, we killed her dad. We did kill her dad. Oh, yeah, and, uh, on. 
on the whole stats thing, where you had, where I was like, but I did kill him or help kill. I misread that, so I was being an idiot at that point in time, which is okay, I suppose. How did I get there so fast? I like this game that is just like automatic. The girl's still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon. I haven't asked. I haven't asked. Just gonna let it stew, huh? Yeah, I don't know. Could I take that bro? Of course not. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. I thought you he was like uh like a duck on water off. What'd he say? He just woke up in the middle of the night, screaming his head off. He thinks he killed Herschel's son. What? Oh Christ. I'm sorry. Fact of the matter is, well, he we kinda did. did. I kinda tried to help. I screwed yeah, sure that up. You're you up for this. Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Uh, oh, oh, shit! Oh, nice. <sighs> eh. Jesus. Are you okay? I'm fine. Shit. I'm sorry, pal. I thought it'd be healed up better. You're lucky it wasn't any worse. You could have. What the heck was Go! that? Go! Go away! Go! Go! Help me! Somebody help me! Oh God! Oh God! What the? What the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. She has an interesting. Scream. It's a girl. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. Oh, she's bit. She's done for. Fuck. We gotta shoot her. Put her out of this mess. You know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Can't think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Uh, she is gonna die. She's been bit. Fuck, man, you're not hitting anything. What the heck? I am. What the frick? Why can't I do anything? Oh, there we go. There's one. Knock it off. Jesus, if you're just gonna shoot, at least fucking hit something now! What the heck? It w you guys saw that. It froze, jerked, and... I had crosshairs on that first one, and nothing was happening. Should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. time now. What? Oh, now I'm on a timer? Oh, god dang it. Come on, come on. Get, get the stuff, get the stuff, get the stuff, get the stuff. Get all of it. Gimme. I think that's everything. That girl didn't die for nothing then. Up and over. 
We're still clear. Let's hustle. Stuff. Oh, what the heck? Ah, fuck you! Oh, not again! Not another endless queue! Can he help? Killed, I guess. I guess that'll be fine. I guess them bandits. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, That's sweet cute. pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. <sighs> I hope Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? I hope Might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. So, what did you get? Everything. A lot of, lot stuff. of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you two, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Uh, Those are bullet holes. Uh, we got enough uh, arrow shafts sticking one. out of it to dry our laundry. Yeah, and that's all beside the fact that Macon is busting at the seams with walkers. We do whatever is best for the kids. Doesn't that make sense? It's suicide out there. We'll die in here. You're right. You could see someone sleeping and kill one of us. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. We're strongest together. It can't be you versus us, Lily. We're sorry for what happened to your dad, but we're in this together now. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you know what about it. medicine? What about medicine? Uh, I don't have Do anything you know to how say. we got these supplies? We got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some Why girl would you say came that? screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. You just let her suffer like what? Like bait? She was dead anyways. Oh God, what is happening? You weren't out there. Oh you guys couldn't try to save her? Don't take that tone with him. It's the first smart thing he's done in a while. Hey, she was dead anyway. That's not nice. Made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth, and it's coming this way. It's not going to be easier out on the road. How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out. 
Well then. Um. She'll get. Over She'll it. get over it. She's riling everybody up. Otherwise. You understand, Ken. She's right about one thing. None of this is getting any easier. See, I'm not even getting choices that I would normally pick anymore. Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Oh yeah, she wants me. <laughs> oh, look at that. She looked back. Oh yeah. Now, nah, wiping that smudge off of my face. Alright, let's go see what she has to say. Talk to Lily yet? No, not yet. I will. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Ooh. I think about I you too. Think about you too. Girl. Our group is small. You're small. <laughs> You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. Oh, what the heck? And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. I should probably tell Kenny and then. You're probably right. Of course I'm probably right. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? Yeah, I'll let people know. I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Call me small. Well, I'm taller than you, so you're pretty small. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her, that's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. Why not? It's the last option. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. Well, all right then. I will get to work. I'll, she's right here, I'll talk to her. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What you doing? There. What's that you're working on, Clem? <laughs> it's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. See, it's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Well, that'd be nice. Uh, do you like do it Do you here? like it here? Probably not. I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah, that'd be a good thing to know. Clem, I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. I was going to prison, then we met. You should know I'm pretty cool. Uh, 
The day you and I met, I was in a car accident. I remember. Your leg was bleeding. The car I was in was a police car, and I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. I, I need I to tell you it. now, because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't think so. You can uh, go on back to your things. Well, that was um, interesting. But uh, I'll talk to them later because I'm sure it's going to be a difficult one. This should be short. Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? Um, I don't want to be in a full conversation. Hey, Ben, I need to tell you something. Sure, Lee. Is it about my watch? I'm trying to do a good job. You're doing fine. How can he mess up a watch? Um, I was, on, I was uh, on my way to prison before this. Whoa, seriously? What um, were you in for? It's not important. What? Oh. Just, if you hear anything, it's probably true. And now you know. Thanks for trusting me, man. I, uh, I... Ben, relax. Okay. <laughs> that was, um, kind of interesting. Uh, do I get to change my answer? Oh, what the heck? Have you weird? seen anything weird on the watch? Is there anybody out there up to anything? Nope. Really quiet. Really? Yeah, totally. Which is good. Yeah. Well then. Talk to you uh, later, Ben. Bye. T bye. Um, should I talk to these two and then pause it or pause it now? I don't know yet. I should really do it now since there's no cutscenes or anything. I should. Because I know this is going to turn into like a. like an hour long. And it's just going to drag on and I'm going to be stressing and everything's just going to. yeah. Everything's not working already, so I might as well just stop while I'm falling behind. So, like, favorite. You know for the reasons. Subscribe. You definitely know the reason of that. And why you should. Because you like this. You like what I do. You like what I say. Probably not. Who cares? I don't. This is fun. I don't know what I'm saying. Whatever. <laughs>